and welcome back everyone to another Zerka Thursday video. This one is cheap versus expensive items challenge. Now, as you know, I am trash at this, but by the looks of it, I think he's going to be blindfolded as well. So it's going to be like more on touch, taste, smell. What the hell is the other one? Hearing. I was like, I was like, shit, let's see the other one. <laughs> So, with that being said, let's see how well Josh can tell a cheap item versus an expensive item. So, let's go. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Welcome today to another Zerka first. Yes. Today we are taking on a nice little challenge of a cheap Shush. versus expensive. Yes. Con and Kirsty behind the camera going okay, away. Okay. He's on shopping and I found a bunch of items that are cheap, some are expensive, and I have nice. to compare them. But blindfolded, so it could be taste, it could be touch, it could be smell. Um, and I've got to try and guess which one is a cheap one, which one is an expensive one. Basically, are expensive products just a gimmick or not? You know, that is a real yeah. question here. So, Con Kirsty, fire away, you know, let me know. Also, what? subscribe. Subscribe. No, 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 no. No, not to you, Con. Yeah, right. Don't Joshua. Yeah, right. What do you want? <laughs> I'm, I'm just kidding, Con. We're taking I'm on Square. Kidding. That's the new one, all right? That's his, that's his name, Square. It's got a square on my. Oh, candle. Candle. Defo candle. And my nose is literally in the wick. A secret here, right? I can't smell anything. Why are you doing smell? I've got COVID nose still. Are they the same flavour? No, unfortunately not. So you've just got two different candles, Similar. and I'm supposed to know which one's what. Oh look, this little ribbing here, this is Yankee Candle style. So there's a label, a lovely flavour right here, you know? Could be like linen or something. Um, I'm not sure. This one's quite like rusty, it's like charcoal, it's like wood. So this is your expense. Hang on, the candles are different though, because you could have shit candles, they're expensive. Is yeah. Yankee Candle expensive? No, it's like 20, 30 quid. This could be 100 quid. This is a bit ropey. That's not a Yankee Candle wick. That is not a Yankee Candle wick. They're much, <laughs> they're much shorter than this. They don't feel like this. It's a scam Yankee Candle. It's like a spanky candle. All right, this is expensive. It's a rustic, expensive, molten brown. It was a spanky candle. <laughs> the, the cheap one is from Aldi. Aldi. So what, 60 pound molten brown Jesus. Russian leather candle, 60 pounds. And then spanky candle, three pounds from Aldi. The thing is though, spanky candle smells nicer for me. That's more of a Freya smell, more of a you smell, right? Russian leather. That is my candle. <laughs> Russian leather of a smell. Like, why, why would you want that as a smell? At like twilight, you know? That's good, I'm keeping this. Pick up Aldi. You can get 20 of these for this. But yeah. Imagine 20 <laughs> like, of these some, candles some for this. Some cheap brands, are, they smell right, good of candle wise. You know what I mean? Tweezers. Also like not knowing what the hell is in front of me. The fuck is that? You can give me like a tampon and I'll start filling it up. Oh, <laughs> tweezers, it's tweezers, it's tweezers. Okay, the key here could be the cap. This has got an expensive cap. That's why I can't be no friends with no cap. Hey. This is a little cheap elastic thing. Listen to the noise. <laughs> Tweezers of all things, you can get expensive tweezers. <laughs> yeah, apparently. Like Amazon, mate, you got Amazon Prime, and just get whatever one delivers first. But if I do my beard, I have a beard like JJ though, like all patchy at the bottom. <laughs> ah! ah! Okay, don't do it on your beard. Do it on that beard. It hurts, it that hurts. Kind of, that one's kind of rough. They're both kind of rough. How do you tell what's more expensive? It's be a brand. This one's got a nice little rough edge here. This one's thicker. That way, it wouldn't even help me. But is there, is there a brand on them? I no, fuck it. This one's more expensive. One to my lip. This is this side because it had a more expensive cap. But it probably that's probably that's probably them like. You know when you got like a small dick and you're overcompensating. That's oh my they're god. Overcompensating with their cap. But I'm gonna go for it anyway. You're right. I was squeeze around. I'm fucking cold. I am cold at this game. You yeah, you're, you're too in charge. Points. Calm down. What do you think the cost, <laughs> like, the price difference is? It's a pound. Okay, yeah, it's a pound. Yeah. <laughs> It's like nine pounds. Well, that pounds. and I was like, when you when you did the little One. testing, if it like if it makes a better noise, like you know, it like like makes that clicky sound. It All right, seems, item it's a number three. I have no general. idea why they oh, want yeah. me in on this one. I honestly don't know why they want me here. Like a dildo, I think. Oh, oh. I'm scared of it. It could be a crab. Me that's bringing a, in a crab. That's a lube right there. <laughs> oh. Put your hands. I need to open this. No, you, 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 you hand, put your hands out. No, you put your hands out. No, you put your out. hands no, out. No, I, hey, I hey, have hey, taken hey. time out of my day to I, come and sit I'm, here and spray this on your hand. Spray and this? It, yes. Oh, is it, it's not lube. That is lube, surely. Josh, let me put it on your hand. <laughs> I don't trust you. I don't want to touch it. Josh, stop it. I don't want lube your hands. I've got to touch. I've got to oh! Josh! <laughs> oh my god. I've got stuff to touch after this. Oh, how are you? Oh, you've got to turn the pump. God, you ain't good at this, are you? Clearly inexperienced virgin. Where are you putting it? Where have you put, why are you putting it there and not on my hand? Sorry, is that not your hand? But it's here, though. 
Can I have tissues, please? No, find out what it is. What is it? How long ago the one is now? What is it? It's lube. I've said this. It's lubricant. You know, sometimes when you're when you're fixing your car, you need to use lubricant to make sure the parts work properly. Why is stringy? He's trying to pick it up, and it's making me feel really uncomfortable. I think that the the tubular one, the longer one, is like I can't smell anything. I feel like the left one is the Durex one, but the right one is like a weird. But yet, took a while. Yet, took a while to get it going. Can I find a pump? Where's the pump, please? I've literally got my hands over it now, it's, it's a mess. Surely they wouldn't charge you a lot for this because there's not much in it. Right, it's, it's fucked. <laughs> the whole tube's fucked. <laughs> Which, how much is Durex? It's cheap, it's what everyone uses. So this would make sense to be more expensive. And they went Poundland and you got some Poundland tweezers and Poundland lube. It's a Poundland lube. I wouldn't trust <coughs> Poundland lube. If Durex is only three quid, that's got to be more expensive. <laughs> you, you think that's the expensive one? Well, if that one's Durex, Durex ain't that expensive, right? Is it six, like five, six quid? Wow, you've changed, bro. Well, can you take this off me? What do you mean? It. Money's changed you, bro. Oh, it's like five, six quid for lube. That's not much, is it? Oh, it was Durex, though. Yeah, it was Durex. Pleasure lubricant. Oh, my hands. No, I'm, I'm getting ready. No, 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 no. Okay, so can I go? Now, tissue. Uh, boots <laughs> Pleasure lubricant. <laughs> Three ninety nine. Yeah. apparently. Yeah. Uh, then we have Durex Strawberry, seven ninety nine. <laughs> Wasn't that half of the price? It's not that cheap expensive, though. You know, you could have got me a 20 quid one or a 30 quid one. Some Harrods thing. Some gold, <laughs> gold lube or something. My God. Cheat out on this one. Oh, okay. Real Dr. Pepper versus fake Dr. Pepper. One of them's called Dr. Pepper, and the other one's called Professor Peppy. Professor Peppy. Hello, Professor Peppy. How do you do? <laughs> uh, uh, do you really think? Uh, uh, stop it. After my years of experience, Josh. surely not. <laughs> Professor Peppy, mate. Hello, Professor Peppy. How do you do? Oh, I'm really good, thank you, Dr. Pepper. Oh, it's too easy. Oh, it's too easy, it was Professor too easy. Come Peppy. Forty two p. Professor Peppy. Don't know. What's this? One pound forty nine or something. Depends where you get it from. Sometimes you get it cheap. Sometimes you got delivery. It might cost you fiver. Yeah, it's, mm. it's zero sugar as well, Professor Peppy. Is it? Is it not, not a full fat Professor Peppy somewhere? I didn't have that one. Yeah, it's, it's just it's different gravy, you know. Professor Peppy. No, thank you. Keep it real. Actually, no, thank you to either of them, you know. I'm a changed man now. Chris Aww. Brown. Is it honey? Oh, wait, that was, yeah, that was honey, right? I just, I looked at the labels and didn't process what the hell I read. Is it a dip? No. It's pesto. <laughs> What happened oh. there? It is liquid. I got, is that lube in my hand again? No. <laughs> oh, it is. I've got lube in my hand from the table. I've got luby hands. There's lube on my container. <laughs> Look, it doesn't move. <laughs> my hands have no grip. It's just liquid. I'm a bad boy. Oh, I don't know. I don't, oh, it doesn't smell good. But that smells like ass. Like actual ass. Can I <laughs> finger it? No, you can eat it with a spoon. I can eat it with a spoon? Yeah. Just what, put a spoon in there? There's a spoon in front of you. Is, that, is it like manuka honey or something? One of them might be. Maybe the more pungent it is, the more expensive it is, surely. This is liquidy uh, honey as well, right? Now this is that like proper manuka honey, like it makes you feel better. <laughs> so I got a bit of hay fever, it might help. Is there someone there? There's definitely someone there. Are you sure? There was someone there. <laughs> there was? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think he's gagged on the spoon. <laughs> <laughs> Josh! Josh! Oh, it's horrid. <laughs> That's ass. Why do bees like that so much? What's wrong with them? Sweeter. This is nicer, so it's cheaper. And this is like some cruddy one that you'd have when you feel really bad, and you just feel, you know what, this will help you. And then some doctor will go, hey, you have some manuka honey on this honey, and it'll make uh. you feel better. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, you did it everywhere. <laughs> oh, manuka honey's ass. Okay, so if your Aldi clear honey was a 85p, and then manuka honey was 25 pounds. Jesus honey. Christ. 25 pounds. Holy hell. I wonder if I've ever had one. I don't know what that is either. I've never had one of those. What are those? Okay, well, I've had an Oreo before. But, uh, those are gonna be easy because the like top cookie, Georgia, no. you know, you know what an Oreo? Oreo top cookie feels like. Oh, Joshua. That can't, that can't be a good Oreo, can it? Surely not. Expensive Oreo right here, aka real Oreo. And that's a Boreo. You can't tell me, can you, yet, either? Again, expensive. Kinder Bueno. But which one? Expensive. Which? That's my childhood right here. What is this, though? This feels like... It's my, what is he even called? Kinder No Bueno. Where's um, <laughs> Mr. Peppy, whatever it's called? <laughs> no, I'm off wait, no. <laughs> Professor <laughs> Peppy. Got, that one. got a mix of both here now. Oh, no. oh. Not too shabby. Well, this one feels like a carpet. Kinder Bueno feels like a Kinder Bueno. This has got some weird texture to it. It's like, is it is it proper solid chocolate all here? 
You're pretty good though. Never write off a cheap product. I'm getting so messy in this video. What's going on? Oh yeah. Jammy Dodger. If I'm correct, does the original Jammy Dodger have like a heart there? And then this has a circle. Is that true? There's not much in the taste. I'm going to back my own trusting the heart because I'm absolutely waffling, but I swear. The Oreo let me down by breaking. You know what it is? I don't have these Oreos. I have the double stuffed ones. They mm -hmm. last more. And I have out the fridge. Cookies and I cream. I love double stuffed. Oh, Wait, how much are these? So like, good. Oreo originals? A pound. A pound? I can get three of these to one of these. About Jeez. 70p. And we have these spirals hazelnut, uh, which are £1.29 for all seven bars that you get inside here. It's about 20p a bar right there. Done though. Less than 20p actually. Done though. Then, even better, right? We have jammy dodgers. And they're not, they're not whammy dodgers. They're jammy wheels. Oh. Oh, jammy wheels. So jammy wheels are 42p. And jammy dodgers are one pound something. One pound nine, one pound eight, one pound seven. Con's on his phone. One pound nine p, we'll make it up, why not? Expensive, why not? Oh, an expensive versus like, wait. I'm gonna say expensive versus expensive watch. Cheap versus expensive watch, Jesus. Indiana uh, Jones. What if you just dropped off? There's only one item there. Why is my, who put Louisville around here still? <laughs> why is there watches? How do you get in a satchel? Take it out. You put it up Indiana Jones. Oh, okay, we have the uh, Jaeger Le Couteur Reverso right here. We also then have, this is a international watch company. <laughs> Schrafhausen, it's a shark fin. Okay, it says Hodinky in the side. Oh, that's, a, that's a great clue. Reverso, Swiss. Hey, the Swiss do make some good watches. Swiss made, 1,000 hours control. Jaeger Le Couteur Formosa. They're both expensive or not? Yeah. They're both over 100 quid. Who gave, why is it in Indiana Jones satchel? Yeah, what do you mean? Harrison Ford. Harrison why are you yeah. laughing? Josh, I can't, I can't reveal my secrets. This one has, this one has a seconds count hand, which I feel like might be more valuable. <laughs> that one just seamlessly move. It doesn't even work. What other clues you look for in a watch? What do you think about the name Reverso? Because the watch is in reverse. It's five to five though, so that is actually the right time. This is 2 p.m. apparently. Surely <laughs> a good watch doesn't run out of battery. Let me check the actual workings of it. This watch belongs in here. Like, why would you put this watch? This watch, it, 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 it's meant to be in here. Wait, and this is not for watches. Is this your watch satchel? Is this your Indiana, Indiana Jones' satchel? Well, how do I guess this? Oh, I think this one costs more. This one smells more like leather. This is like that's like real leather. I don't know why you're smelling it. Cause leather, <laughs> right? <laughs> well, what smell? Sure, metal. Josh, why not? This one's overdoing know. it on the back with the information. You know, this is like some Michael Kors price range. 150 quid. He smiled. That's not good. <laughs> 300 quid, 400 quid, 500 quid, I don't know. It's been worn, so it's, it's, it's got lesser value, right? It's, it's not a retail price, only retail price because it's been worn considerably. Someone put some hours into this, and <laughs> different sizes as well. Maybe they've lost weight over, over time. Or they, or they gained weight, maybe. I may just passed someone, actually, I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> All right, reveal, reveal. The gold one, the Cal 89 shark fin, 1,000 pounds. This has to be expensive compared to this then. Can I show you why it's called Reverso? Oh, it's it's going to be it's more expensive, surely not. Show you why it's called Reverso. Surely it's not more expensive. So this is usually worn by polo players and they don't want to damage the watch. They just reverse it. Well, that's not fair. I didn't get to see that part, did I? <laughs> How? Because you all you I did, did was it, smell it, bro. If, just, I, if I had did that, I would have run away thinking I broke the watch. That's cool, isn't it? The reverse, though. Guess the price now. Yeah. Infotainment is more expensive. Okay. This is just cool. This is some one by polo players. Polo players got peas, to be fair. Mm. All right, it's like four bags then, easy, isn't it? That's a little bit more than you're rolling. Oh no. Ten. Oh. Ten. Oh, for Jesus. It's quite cool though. It is. It <laughs> I is. It all day, it is that, cool. that, that, I did that on my watch all day doing this. I got it wrong. Yeah, you got it wrong. Ten bags. Yeah. That's not cheap. That's still a grand. Oh, that's <laughs> a fifty quid watch. I said they're both not cheap, but one of them. Give me a G Shock. Casio. <laughs> oh, expensive oh, cologne. Oh, it smells around here. It's cologne. That's the bottle. Oh. I don't feel the bottles yet. Oh, what's this? And then in this hand. Pretty good. The other card. I am, like, am I holding it the right way? No. no, try the other way. Are you sure? What is this? I hope this ain't cheap. I hope it is cheap. I can buy it. Is it, is it aftershave or is it perfume? Perfume. Oh, fuck it. I can't I'll buy it anyway. <laughs> I was like, do it nice. anyway, Josh. Do it. Cheap perfume. Like the candle. Do it. Do it. Do whatever the hell you want. <laughs> and the brand gets you the price. So it might be this, this, like, this, might, this might last like 10 minutes, but this might last hours and hours and hours. Mm. And this is there, you know, mellow. Oh, it's tiny. Is that tiny for a perfume? Or, 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 or female, just small. Oh, an interesting shaped bottle. They're trying to over, they're overdoing it, you know. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. Maybe the fact it's such a tiny bottle. Look. 
It's expensive, this is. You man can't afford the bigger one. That's why it is like, oh, I'm not spending this on Josh. We're spending your budget, mate. <laughs> you know, I'll Josh need no perfume. Expensive. We're just gonna run it, we're just gonna run it. We're going for it. This one smells so much nicer. So I'm gonna, I like it more anyway. But I'm just saying with perfumes, it's hard to gauge sometimes. You can get a Poundland perfume, but it smells incredible, but it lasts like five minutes. I ain't got five minutes to wait here, you know? <laughs> so just run it. This one, yes? No, maybe? Black opium. Black dusk. <laughs> East in the wall. This one's nice. That's actually Kirsty's one pound one. Yeah. One pound? This is one pound. I saw it on TikTok. Everyone was saying it smells like it and I wanted to test it. It doesn't. No, it's, it it does. It. I can't smell it. 55 pounds black opium, East Sin Laurel. Uh, and one pound black dusk. Where's this from? Poundland. Poundland. Told Jeez. you about the Poundland. Oh, t shirt. Oh, t I'm gonna guess a t-shirt. You know how hard a t-shirt's gonna be? Because it could be like some plain white t-shirt or something and it would have like a little logo right here and it would say 90 quid. And this might be from TK Maxx and it would say two pound. It's got a label in it still. Was that a label? Who didn't cut out the label? I have you. I have you now, mister. Okay, that's a good clue. It's got a good label on it. It's not some pesky embossed label. Very, very soft, a bit rougher. Feeling for labels, you know, to see if I can get a gauge of a label. There's no label in there, oh, there is a label. Cheap plastic labeling right here. Mm -hmm. Hey, you guys are messed up, I've got you. On the ropes. Don't know me as Tommy T. Hey, Feels pretty don't good. Know about Feels like a t-shirt I could wear. It's nice little, that's like a little t to try on test about trying it on. Oh, this has got some weight to it. Some, it's got some GSM different in here. This is heavy. It's not as soft, but it's heavier. They spent money on their fabric, maybe. Soft isn't always the key. What's this then? The line at the top. The line. It's a bit rounded off at the bottom. Fuck it, this is an expensive one. Yes? I'll find out. Where's that logo still? I don't know. Is it Burberry? Burberry. Told you. Is there even a logo on this one? This is just primarily coming through. <laughs> Literally you see, exactly this is, what Josh said. This one. There's, not, there's not enough stuff to it. Two pounds for the Primarni t-shirt. And it's Burberry, so it's going to be in the hundreds. We can't return it either. <laughs> yeah, we can't return it either. <laughs> 230 pounds. That's fine. I'll wear a, Bur Jeez. I'll wear a Burberry t-shirt. It's fine. <laughs> my, my budget on my video. Please subscribe, guys. Please. Please. Yeah, subscribe what are you to doing? Josh. It's not the Sidemen channel. What is that? Oh, night cream. Okay, I was like, uh huh, I don't know what this is. Could be a moisturizer? It's a moisturizer, right? Yes. Uh, I'm moisturizing my face with like an ass moisturizer or something. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> no! It's, it, it, it smells pretty. It smells pretty nice. <laughs> If it's frush cream, it smells pretty nice, you know, put it on your face, why not? If you're in a rush, you know, just use some frush. Sometimes these cheap companies don't overdo it, they give like some pretty, pretty colourful and stuff as well, right? When they've got the protective thing on it, you know they're about their business. Lancome, Lancome, you know, that brand whatever it's called. Yeah, different, smooth, rubs in easy, this is like sun cream, this is just, it's in there, it's already, it's already been swallowed up by my skin, it loves it. My, my skin's eating good now. Lancome, expensive. Dunno, no, the dunno. No. Nah, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Josh is too good at this. To like Same as me. It pisses me off. See that? You see me? All bright with hibiscus night cream. Fuck off. Uh, long com, generic repair. No, no, genetic repair. Repair? No, thank you. This is like probably 60 quid, 50 quid, 4 quid. 6.99, uh, 55. I know my stuff, you see. I know my stuff. Seriously, I don't know how Josh I know my is stuff, just... you see. Josh is just so good at Balenciaga, Balenciaga shoes. What do you mean? What, 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 huh? Why? What? This is not the Simon Channel Con. You need to chill, fam. Chill. A box. Is it a shoe box? Shoelaces. Ah, oh, that's good. Right, let's go one at a time then. I wonder what's expensive. You got a custom pair of shoelaces and you get a bag with it. And these are my size. If you bought me in someone else's size, then this is a violation. What the fuck is this? Pair of no two ways, no? They got a whole thing in it as well. They got a, they got a bunda <laughs> of a shoe on the shoe, look. Okay, let me just put it off the train. <laughs> I wonder which one is the cheap one. It couldn't be bothered to connect the box. What on earth is this? This is like the Balenciaga uh, sock crepes. They actually aren't. These are Balenciagas. Does that mean these, they're not, these aren't actually Balenciagas, are they? Like the moon boot style ones. Has there been a box switcheroo? Nah. These wouldn't fit in this box. Oh. <laughs> oh, Josh. These are in Kirsty's size. You little scallywags, you got yourself some Balenciaga socks. You can fool me on my channel. Do you know who I am? And what earth are these? These are crepes. These are giant crepes. 
Hello? With plenty of argument. <laughs> Hello? They feel, they feel a ham. One hand, need two hands. I mean, whoever's got these size crepes, I've got a huge hog, surely, oh clearly. Oh my Not god. What they say? <laughs> fuck off, plenty of argument things. Josh. Big fuck off hog. Is this the right foot? That's not the right foot, is it? Uh, not your size. <laughs> it's not my size. Uh, <laughs> I'm good at this game, though. Plenty of you got these. Oh, <laughs> but, but you want these. They're not even in my size, they're a size four. That's right, Fred's a size four. <laughs> ah. You thought you could catch me out. 25 pounds, TK Maxx. 790. Jesus Christ. Balenciaga. Hey. Ah. Oh, oh, Jim, you know. Well, it's fairly in games about to start, so chin chin. Wait. This is your favorite drink. No way. In here, it smells like nail polish. Is my nose working? You're testing it, me against my own favourite drink. But I'm concerned now, because I can't smell the difference. I can smell a perfume in my nose. Yeah. This, is, this is Coco Canoe, yeah. and this is Coco... Coco Bay. It's not, it's not, that, not that strong. Yeah, that smells like Coco Bay. This is more expensive than good. This is Coco Canoe, it's 20 quid. 20 so quid. this is three quid. Come on, the Coco Bay. You know, get yourself, what the hell? Get yourself crunk on the Coco <laughs> Bay. In the game's about to start, I need to go. So, if you enjoy it, leave a like, and as always, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Please subscribe, 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 come through. <laughs> subscribe to me, not the square, you know? Because yeah. we want subscribers in the square. Catch you up on him, though, if we are. It's, look, it was easy. The E-boy is in the mud, mate. Down there yeah. somewhere, eventually. Oh, no. Um, so, yeah. I'll see you guys Josh. next time. Bye. It's coming home. It's coming. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I hate to be the bearer of bad news, Josh, but it, it, it's not coming home. I'm sorry. It's, it's not coming home. It's not. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Josh. It just, it, sorry. I know you guys really wanted it to come home, but it's, it's not. It's really not. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But other than that, how well did you guys do in the, well, I mean, obviously we can do a lot better because we're seen, but you know what I mean? Uh, like in your mind, how well do you think you could have done? Because I would have done awful like i would have done absolute trash like mm -mm, it wouldn't have worked not good at all mm -mm. so but hopefully you guys did enjoy this zika thursday video make sure you go subscribe to josh all the links to josh are down in the description as always so make sure to go check out him we need to beat him too we need to beat the square as you said <laughs> aka Will and E because we're very very close to overtaking him I'm pretty sure by now we might have I don't know 100% sure but you never know <laughs> so um yeah hopefully you guys did enjoy and I'll see all you beautiful wonderful people in the next video all right bye